Hi, in this video we will see how to install Eclipse in Ubuntu 14.04 LTS. So, first we need to go to the Eclipse download site and the latest version of Eclipse is Eclipse Luna uh, which is 4.4.1 release. So, I will be using Eclipse ID for Java E. Uh, you can use just about any version. The steps will be the same. So, we will select the OS type and then you need to download it from one of these uh, mirrors. You can click on one of these mirror links and the Eclipse will be downloaded. I have downloaded it already so you can find it once downloaded you can find it in the downloads folder the file will be a dot tar dot gz file so first you need to extract this file So, the file is being extracted. So, once the tar.gz file is extracted, you will see this Eclipse folder. So, we need to move this Eclipse folder to the slash opt folder, uh, which is over here. OPT but you can't just move it like normal way you can't just copy and paste it here because uh, uh, you need to first open not less as root user so we'll close it close this window and open terminal and we'll type GKSU not less press enter you'll need to provide your administrative password so now click on computer home uh, your username downloads and then right click on the eclipse folder copy then go back to computer opt and then right click and paste so now the eclipse folder is copied to opt if you want you can leave this folder with the same name but I'll be renaming it to Eclipse Luna and press enter so now uh, you can actually run Eclipse from here if you want you can double click on Eclipse and you can run it if you want but we'll uh, create a shortcut for Eclipse on launcher and uh, we'll finish the installation properly so we'll do some more steps I'll cancel this okay I just wanted to show you that you can run it but right now you can't find Eclipse over here so you'll have to do some more steps so what we'll do is we'll open gedit from the terminal so first we can close this notless file manager and we'll type gksu 
g edit and press enter type your administrative password so once you have g edit open you need to type the following uh, desktop entry version name etc so this is the version of eclipse that you are using uh, and this is the name of the eclipse uh, whatever you want to uh, want it to be shown on the dash and generic is just a generic name and then the comment uh, which is not that important and this is the path where you have actually copied eclipse uh, remember we copied eclipse to opt folder so inside o opt you will find uh, there is an eclipse uh, which we ran earlier so uh, we are linking to that and then this is to say that we don't want it to open in terminal and this is the icon file uh, which will be used uh, like these icons uh, so uh, that will be the eclipse icon and that is also from the same folder eclipse luna folder from opt and the type is application and category is just application and utility so after this you need to save it so right now we are uh, using gedit as root so we'll be able to write onto the usr share applications folder so we need to give a name for this we can give any name so i'll give eclipse luna and the extension should be dot desktop and then you need to save the file so once you have saved this file you can find this file over here computer usr share applications eclipse luna java e so this name is the name that we gave here and now you can also find it over here the application is ready to use we'll do a couple more things uh, you can actually click and use it from here but we'll do a few more things you can actually close this now can close this uh, I will leave this open for now and to make a launcher icon you just need to drag the Eclipse icon from here so that's how you create launcher icon so suppose if you want to create suppose if you want to create an icon for uh, desktop then the step would be going to USR share applications folder and right clicking on the Eclipse Luna Java E copy and then on the desktop you need to right click and paste so that's how you install Eclipse Luna or just about any release of Eclipse uh, we'll run it and check you can run it from any place from here or from here or from here just double click and Eclipse is running you can select a workspace and our Eclipse is ready for use so that's how we install Eclipse on Ubuntu. Hope you like this video. 
I have more such videos on my YouTube channel. Please have a look. Uh, if you like my videos, please subscribe, like and share. If you have any questions, please post on the comment section below. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.